always a nice surprise here, you know? There's always something that's not... Whoa! I've been looking for an S5. Is it listed or not? Can you look no, at it? No, this just no? came in. They came in the yard to yard. Okay. Uh, got a little bit of everything. Yeah. Um, no, I, I definitely am interested in that um, S5. because I. You want a Wolfsburg Edition 66 Bug? I don't know what that is, but I know people on the internet will. <laughs> yeah, there's so much brush work and polish and chrome on this thing, dude. Not to mention the, six, the four rims that are on it. Mm -hmm. It's an 1800cc, but you know, it's not a Super Beetle, because it doesn't have the Super Beetle bumper. Yeah. And look at the emblem on the steering wheel. It's a Wolfsburg Edition VW. Oh, wow. Yeah, I know Wolfsburgs are Wolfsburg's like... Wolfsburgs a track. Yeah, wow. I mean, dude, you got glass, you mm -hmm. got a motor, you got a hell of a start. For yeah. somebody that really loves old Beetles, oh, it's a 13, not a... Because the Super Beetles were like... Eight. Look at the exhaust pipes, though. That's what I'm saying, dude. <laughs> wow. There's a lot of good car in there. Dude. Except for mm -hmm. this one in H is going to be down that hill, so we'll kill everything in this area and then go down the hill. Yeah. So, I'm excited to fuck that thing up. Apparently, it's a super expensive car. Which is it's in the back five? Thing? Yeah. The bid on it right now is like 10 or 15 grand. Really? Yeah. If it's the car that I think you're talking about... So like a GT40, it's like a race car. Yeah, it, it looks like it's it looks like a Ferrari. Yeah, it's, a, yeah. it's Ford's. Yeah, it's this a, is a clone car though. It's a, it's a clone? It's not a real one, it's a clone. Oh. Because it's got a, it's got a um, LS6 in it, and you, you'll tell when you get oh. up to it. Somebody took, um, you'll see, it's all Corvette suspension that somebody put on a loop. I'm not a big fan of kit cars to yeah, be honest. I could start better by building one. Yeah, we're looking for this. Uh, it should be right here. 335 right now, right? Silver side damage. Could be on this side too or no? No, it's no? right in here. I'm okay. just going to go in. I'm just going to go in and want. Mm -hmm. I'm hoping it has an aftermarket exhaust and sounds nice. Yeah. I think it's a rear wheel drive one. Oh, this is a it. Nice body style too. Yeah. All right, let's see what we got here. All right, that wheel is definitely shifted backwards. The airbag, the airbag curtains on the right are blown. Can you hit something? Yep. Right here, look at it. Right on the tire, right there. Yep, I could have, yeah, this is it. Okay. Not a fan of this interior color, I'll tell you that much. It's manual though. Yeah. That's a huge plus for these cars. Yeah, let's see. So this thing's not, not listed as run? Uh huh. So there should be something with, like sometimes when the front end's messed up like that, the electronics won't let you start the car. You know, all the new fancy stuff, because now it's electronic drive shafts, and there's nothing, no more gearboxes like used to. If, you know, if, if you blow your airbag, sometimes you can't even steer the car anymore, you know? Yeah. Because it's I... not even connected to a gearbox. Five speed. My brother just put a brand new motor in it, bored and stroked it. The thing's like a mad sleeper, hey? Oh, really? I brought it up from Rhode Island. I'm doing like fourth gear, like 85, and this guy in a 5.0 Mustang just pulls like alongside of me, and I'm like, <laughs> all right, bro. And whoa, and he goes, whoa, and I'm like, whoa, fifth gear. Go, go, go. It's a 2006 Ford Factory 5 GTM. Okay. Believe me, I don't know anything about that. domestic. It is not that. I don't know anything about domestic cars. You'll see it when I show you. Yeah. You'll see the fiberglass around the uh, where the headlight goes. Those cars are like three hundred ton thousand, maybe even five hundred yeah, thousand yeah. dollar car. Do you guys still have the Tesla Model X here? Uh, I think it's sold. Oh really? You like B12 BMW? Yeah, definitely. They, a guy wants like six grand for it. He's almost sold it to the guys in the parking lot. He's like, you know what you do with? That? Yeah, V12 is insane. Yeah, absolutely nice insane. Out of all the cars here, it's one of my favorites. Wow. Yeah, I'm gonna give. I was gonna roll deep and go looking for people and hunting heads. This is yeah. the car I'd be riding in. Uh huh. Wow, yeah, this <laughs> thing's not bad. It leaks in the tranny though, so it's gonna need full service. Oh, yeah. But it was clean when I pulled it in. V12, wow. Let's start this thing. 
He's gone. Stolen? Probably dealer inside. Oh yeah. Like sometimes the cars are really nice. They don't like people messing with them, so they'll just take. The car oh yeah, that. Yep, I see it. Just take a take a look at the, the headlights. Light is not far enough out or oh, it's yeah. on the wrong side. Yeah, no, this looks made. a little weird, yeah. Really cheaply made. Really cheaply made. Look at that front wheel. It's all that's all that's all Corvette parts in there, hey. That's a Corvette upper and lower control arm. Suspension? Yep. Coney? That's a shock. Mm -hmm. I don't know, like oh, I just haven't heard of they're this not, company. They're like blue um I've seen on the shock it says factory five racing. Fiberglass? Yeah, awful. Yeah. The thing about the other cars, the real ones have one of these open up the body kit, this comes right off. Mm -hmm. Unless you get like the street legal version one that, dude, if you put this next to a real one, you'd know. Those mm -hmm. are Whoa, I like these pipes. Yeah. I like these Here, pipes. This, out. this one opens up. After the frame might be torqued on this thing. Oh, There's yeah. a lot more here than you think. Yeah. So that's why I'm just... Don't get me wrong, man. You could definitely make something really awesome with this thing. Mm -hmm. But I just try to let people know as much because everybody comes here and thinks that it's all glory. Mm -hmm. and, you know, it ain't gravy every day, bro. Sometimes yeah. you drink broth. We're seeing like mold here on the floor. That's what I'm saying. On the seats. Oh, this... Definitely want to hear this engine. Let's get a... That's cool. I'm yeah. not gonna lie. You know what? There's one over here too. Get. I want to get at least that open or started, but I don't think we're gonna get that far. I don't think we are. Oh, you think it's open? Oh, sweet. There she is. Wow. Dang. I bet this thing would sound crazy. Yeah, started. something like 600 and something, something horse. When they, when they did, they did get it running. I yeah, think it's not even started. a battery in it, so we took the battery out of it. Look. So, oh, we won't even be able to start it. I mean, we could hook it up, but I don't want to kind of hack. Hook it. You want to try and turn it over? Oh. I definitely want to try starting it. Yeah. This thing's gonna sound crazy loud. Wow, this thing's gonna be loud. This thing looks pretty nice. I like this this design around the headlights. A lot of components on it on it are fiberglass, like this fender here that's broken. Although I don't know anything about this car, this might be a kit car. This is a beast though. When this thing gets started up right now, this thing's gonna scream. I mean, this thing is just gonna roar. It resembles a Corvette so much, it's crazy. I'm gonna go ahead and take, take this tape off so I can open the door. So this is what the inside looks like. Really basic. There's a bunch of water leaking in. This thing's got mold all over, so I don't really wanna go inside. Here's the dash. 